into it. Oh, pedal out of the start. I think, but we won't hold that against him. He needs every chance he can get. Here he comes. Oh. <laughs> I forgot to tell you, Steve Peters wasted! Yeah! Strategically avoiding the right though. Very nice down the back straight, whips it in! Oh, nice! Oh, he's thrown it away! No rebounds in the final. The pressure is getting to everyone so far. Mechanics, been working pretty hard to get us uh, something trick for worlds. Rock shops can us some white forks and uh, a few little trick bits here and there, so pretty stoked with the whole look of it. Red, white and blue. In your tank top, rainbow yeah, I feel, yeah, I know that I can do well and of course I think that's what gives me confidence, but then again it's a new race and and last year it was World Cup, this year it's World Champs and some guys just can ride better at World Champs than they do at World Cups and there's different pressures and you know at the end of the day if you win this you're World Champion. Came back back to my worst and um just from what I'd heard about the track, it's pretty sweet. So I've been enjoying practice, getting my lines dialed in, trying not to peak too early, and um, going to give it what I can on Sunday. The track's pretty easy, really. On a whole, it's quite easy. It's just you just got to get all these little edges and make sure you're just carrying speed on. Not really the top section, the rocks. That's easy. We do that kind of shit all day long on the real rough stuff but it's more these sort of burns and little tiny hits and coming out of a turn and carrying speed that this track's a lot flatter than tracks that we usually ride on and so that's going to be key to winning this race is carrying speed good on this bottom sort of flatter section. But then you told me you would move away And you look so cute It's definitely a different atmosphere than a World Cup. I think people, the riders are more uptight, I think. I know Greg's fitness is he's ready. So, it's him and Steve are the men to beat. I'm pissed off because I could have done better, but um, whatever. Schwadming's in a couple of weeks, so look out because it's a downhill track. But then you told me you would move away. And you looked so cute there, you were crying, crying, crying. To lose by such a little bit. I mean, I gave it my all. Uh, I kind of know where uh, I've made a mistake, and uh, you know, it's this race, and you only have one chance of world champs at that point. Um, trying to fix it, just got to do it all in that run, and Steve did it today. First time in his career, and it's a moment here, yeah, it's an awesome time. about to collapse. Shit! G was two seconds down, I thought I had it then. And I sat on the back of that car, just just wanted to cry. Like, just emotion was coming over me, I wanted to cry. I'm like, finally, have I done it, have I done it? I don't, you don't know until he crosses that line. Rainbow Star
Sheffield Steel, son. Sheffield Steel. Working out to do deep on that last last pedal section. And uh, it's not sunk in yet. Definitely not. It's got, got the got the white jersey. Yeah. Good shit. <laughs> 